Yo, what's going on, people? Welcome back to another video. Bear folks here, and today I've got you the video you all were requesting for how to enable RTX and GeForce Now free edition. Alright, I'm gonna make this video as fast as possible. So, first up, all you have to do is open up your browser and uh, search for GeForce Now. And I highly suggest you guys to, you know, download GeForce Now using a American VPN. That means you have to choose a US location in the VPN and download this app using a US location VPN. This is a major step, so I highly suggest you guys don't skip this part. Once downloaded, install GeForce Now and log in to your account. Now here comes the part, RTX on will work only in some games as most of the games won't even pop up to change the settings. So I'll take Fortnite as an example here. I really don't know how long it will take to patch it but if you guys do it early then it will work. Go to your GeForce Now location. So for that all you have to do is start searching GeForce Now and open file location then uh, a file manager will open up in front of you so you have to go to the file location once again and once you are here do the following changes find geforcenow.json right click on that and hit edit all right once you are here scroll all the way down and make sure that we have the nvsdl iohid configurable true and the nvgfn rtx true if this does not show in your notepad, then you can add it. Just uh, type the exact same thing, nv-gfn-rtx equal to true. Or you can wait for the new update or reinstall the new update and this option will show up. So by default, it will be false, but you have to turn it to true. Once done with that, close the thing and open up GeForce now. Okay, now once you are here, go to the settings section and over there, um, scroll all the way down and make sure that you have the direct mouse input uh, enabled. And then the streaming quality, go to custom for the max bitrate, use custom and go for 15 Mbps. Uh, copy the exact same settings and go back to your games. Once done with that, open up Fortnite, hit play, open Fortnite and hit play. Alright, so once you are in game, all you have to do is go to the settings and over there scroll down and make sure that you have the DLSS to quality and the ray tracing on and everything on the highest settings possible. And then hit apply and hit back and you can play the game as you want. I hope this video helps you out guys and if it did make sure to leave a like and hit the subscribe button. We are really close to 15k subscribers and I believe in y'all so see you in the next video. Until then stay tuned, keep watching Bear Fox and peace out.